Trigo Treat Trigo Trick Too many treats Will make you sick You can have that one for free If you want to know your future Or need some advice You can call on me For a small price My gift of sight Grows stronger on this night A Halloween blessing From the shadows on the other side Treat or trick Trick or treat If you have any tricks up your sleeve Come sit next to me Watching you from behind a tree I see you, you don't see me I disappear, dear But I am near, dear Waiting, oh, so patiently For your candy You want to give me all of your candy. You belong to me now. It was so easy now. Look into my yellow eyes and see. You want to give me all of your candy. Old Mr. Johnson had troubles of his own. He had a little cat which wouldn't leave his home. He tried and he tried to give the cat away. He gave it to a man going far, far away. But the cat came back the very next day. The cat came back. The Goner, but the cat came back. She just couldn't stay away, 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 away. He gave it to a man going way out west. Told him for to take it to the one he loved the best. First the train hit the curve, then it jumped the rail. Not a soul was left behind to tell the gruesome tale, but the cat came back the very next day. The cat She was a goner, but the cat came back. She just couldn't stay away, 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 away. I went down the St. James Infirmary. See my mistress there. She had been recently turned into a pumpkin. So pale, so orange, so fair. Let her go, let her go, God bless her. Wherever.
never see, maybe. She may search this wide world over and never find a sweet cat like me. When I die, please bury me in my heart of Staten Head. Put a twenty dollar gold piece on my collar chain so my gang will know I died standing pat. I want six crab shooters for my polar bearers. Pretty girls to sing me a song Put a jazz band on a hearse wagon To raise cane as we roll along Now you've heard my story And I swear every word is true And if anybody happens to ask you I've got the St. James Infirmary Blue When the last breath of summer is a dying song When the wind grows chill and shadows long when the darkness comes early to blot out the day, that's when the monsters come to play. I've got a riddle just for you, better get it right. What's tall and dark and green and blue? What's standing right behind you? Preparing to take a bite when you wake and it's dark as the blackest pit. When you reach up to scratch a terrible itch with the claw where your fingernails used to be that's when the monsters have said
que salgo Boy began to sigh Looked up at the sky Told the moon his little tale of war Oh, shine on, shine on harvest moon Up in the sky I had no love in since January, February June or July, oh, snow time, ain't no time to sit. Ador then spoon, oh, shine on, shine on the harvest moon for me and my guy. Bad luck for seven years. Step on a crack, there goes your poor mama's back. If the 13th of Friday has you cowering in fear, I can't imagine you're too fond of black cat you got a Considered good luck for centuries, darling. Even worshipped as gods in ancient Egypt. Now, there is no need to be nervous around little old me. <laughs> Meow. There's a mist in the air tonight. As we celebrate the gateway to everyone's favorite season of darkness, it's that special feeling, knowing spirits are on the streets, undetected by your weak human senses. Put on your disguise Or you may become a hotel For a ghost tonight On Halloween 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 I love chocolate, but it goes straight to my hips, darling. These days it's all treats and no tricks. When I was a kitten, a good trick would send some people completely over the edge, babbling incoherently for days. Oh, it was great fun. Once upon a time, it was practically another lifetime, I was a witch's familiar, but she was turned into a pumpkin, so now I'm free to do as I please. Did you know that cats, such as myself, have the gift of sight? That means we can predict the future, Bubula. Remember to 
brush your teeth tonight before bed, dearest. Otherwise, they will all fall out, and it will be only pea soup and mush for the rest of your life. How sad for you. A ghost is following you, darling. Can you not see? If you ignore it, it will become sad and go away. Everyone knows ghosts are obsessed with attention. It's a common misconception that cats and werewolves do not get along, but that's simply not true. Ain't no party like a werewolf party, because a werewolf party don't stop. Last year's Halloween dance macabre at Dracula's house in the hills was a scream, darling. But thank you so much for inviting me to your home this year. It's fine. Shoo, foul demon! This human has no life energy left! A demon was draining you of your life force, my dear, so I'll forgive the enormous bags under your eyes. I have hobnobbed with the who's who of the underworld, my love. While your costume is adorable, it will take a bit more to scare me. Oh, that's just how you look? I stand corrected. A vision has struck me. One among you will be cursed before the night is through, doomed to a wretched existence for the rest of eternity. But it's probably not you, Bubula. At least I'm pretty sure. Don't be fooled by my cute and cuddly appearance. I am capable of a great many things, only some of which are cute and cuddly. The indignities I suffered at the hands of my mistress were endless. For instance, she once attempted to rub my soft little belly, the fool. A mistake she made only once. Oh, my days as a familiar were a whirlwind of potions and parties, midnight mayhem and magic. But being a familiar was never satisfactory. Oh, no. My hunger for power grows still, and soon I will make my move. Have you ever seen two warlocks dueling in the black of night? Oh, my darling, you simply must attend a duel with me sometime. We'll disguise you as my pet zombie or something, so no one tries to steal your soul. You should have seen me in my youth. So beautiful, so terrible. You would bow before me, mortal. You would fear my wrath! Did you say something? I'm sorry, I must have blacked out. That's happening more and more these days. I tried my hand at the witch thing once, as a human woman, of course, to get a full experience. Did you know that humans cannot bathe themselves with their own tongues and must instead use <laughs> water? Simply appalling. On Halloween night, the veil is so thin that all manner of otherworldly creatures cross unseen into our realm. Well, unseen by your weak human eyes, you poor dears. With only five senses, there's no wonder you only have one life. Not to brag, darling, but I've been a guest at some of the most exclusive monster mashes in history. Monsters adore me because, let's face it, I'm adorable. Ghosts are such hopeless romantics, sulking around, waiting to be reunited with their true love. It's pathetic. Go to the light, honey. It's been 200 years. He ain't coming back. Vampires, on the other hand, are the most vicious and the best looking, other than us felines, of course. Anyone who falls prey to their silly nonsense deserves what they get. Demons are just my type. Felines and demons have a very special bond that goes back centuries, my love. 
It doesn't hurt that they're smoking hot with a devilish charm to match. Me, yow. Back in the old days, people would leave offerings of treats at my door for good health and good fortune. Those who didn't, well, let's just say things didn't always work out for them. I wouldn't wish harm upon a soul for not leaving me a small candy offering, my sweet link. It's not my fault if ill fortune befalls a bad tipper. That's just karma. A vision overcomes me. If you pass out pennies on Halloween, beware. You are in grave danger of being pulled through the veil into the realm of the monsters. For who but a monster gives out pennies on Halloween? So such as myself will steal your soul in the middle of the night, which is frankly absurd. Soul stealing happens during litter box time when a cat is looking deep into your eyes. Everyone knows that. It is quite beautiful, 100% organic and softer than the feathers of the dove I ate for lunch. Do you want to pet it? Well, don't even try it or I'll rip you to shreds! Lack of self-control. Candy-thieving goblins are out in hordes this night. later to dance with the devil in the pale moonlight. Finally, I will take my throne back from that washed-up has-been! But I cannot complete my glorious rise to power wearing this, so ta-ta! Silent face mode. 